Okay, when you start your lining drills, especially with a young dog, you want to keep everything short. Make everything easy, keep everything under control. Um, don't let your macho-ism uh, get too far ahead of you where you want your dog running out at 100 yards and jumping over creeks and doing all this kind of stuff to show off to your friends. Start small. Start with very short distances, especially with a young dog, because that's how you're going to breed success. So for a lining drill, and what you want to do is you want the dog to see where you're dropping the dummy. So I'm going to drop the dummy here, leave it, no. And I'm going to take Ember just a short distance away. Ember, heel. Hey, heel. 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 Good girl, stay. Okay, so that's, I don't know, 15 feet, okay? But she knows where the bird is because now I'm gonna give her a line. So I want her to know that, okay, that line is sending me to where the bird is. Very simple if you think about it, stay. Mark, 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 back. Good girl, good girl, good girl, good girl, good girl. Now I exaggerated the good girl. I don't do that so much with her. Uh, and you see she dropped the bird. Certainly you don't want that to happen. But with a younger dog, that kind of encouragement, reinforcement, good girl, yeah, 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 you want them to know that what they just did was the greatest thing in the world. Okay, so yeah, th that encouragement is good. Now something else you can work when you're, um, it's always good to, you know, to drop the, the dummies as I, as I just did. You can eventually, and this is something you can do in your backyard. You don't need to go to a field to do this. You just need a small area to do this in. Theoretically, you could do this in your kitchen. You could put something down 10, 15 feet away from you and do it right there. And you're just emphasizing, it's seeing what you want it to get, it's taking a line to it, and you're telling what a good girl she was when she brought it back to you. So stay. So just, I'm just gonna throw one. I wouldn't do that at the beginning. I would, let, I would drop them and let them see. Um, stay. Stay. And when you, it's probably a good time to talk about the word mark. Um, because you always want the dog control. You always want the dog sitting. This is a good time where it's in a controlled situation. She knows where the bird is to reinforce the, the, the mark. So you're, you're down here in patience. You want the dog to not to break until you tell it to. I mean, there are a lot of other things that you've got to do to get the dog to sit like this. But this is one of the things along the way that you can do in any kind of a drill is mark, 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 stay, stay, good girl. Stay, sit, sit, stay. Okay, so you're teaching the dog patience. She's driving her crazy right now because she's nothing she wants more to do than to go after that bird. But the dog has to learn it doesn't go after anything until you tell it to. And they get to associate the retrieve with, the, with commands too. If I tell her mark, mark, and then I say blueberries, that's not the command. Blueberries doesn't mean anything to her. But if I say mark, mark, fetch. Good girl, good girl, good girl, fetch, fetch, stay, stay. Very important, and that's the first thing, again, you can line them up, so you can have her do one at 10 feet, come back, do one at 20 feet while they're all out there. That's helping to know that she wants to get the short one first, but it's that, get them in a straight line. I would probably, with a younger dog, get closer to the, to the wall than I've done right here, because that's key to this. This is the edge so that they're not veering too far left and right. But that's another advantage of the short distance while they're learning the drill is you're not giving them too much of an opportunity to go off in another direction. The further the dog gets away from you, the more opportunity uh, she might have to get distracted or to want to go you know, 20 yards left, 20 yards right. Because the purpose of this drill, straight line out, straight line back.